What's up viewers? This is your Matthew Bay. So in this video, papasadahan natin yung course description and yung coverage or yung course outline ng construction materials and testing. So yung course description and yung course outline, kinuha natin sa CHED Memorandum Order number 92 series of 2017 which is being used for the curriculum for the school year 2018-2019 onwards. So, ito yung curriculum na ito. So, this is applicable in all schools in the Philippines since the basis of our lectures or and the topics is the CHED Memorandum Orders. So, let's start with the course description. So, the course deals with the physical properties of common construction materials, primarily metals, plastics, wood, concrete, coarse and fine aggregates, asphalt, and synthetic materials, examination of material properties with respect to design and use of end product, design and control of aggreg aggregates, concrete and asphalt mixtures, principle of testing, characteristics of tests, properties of materials, and materials testing equipment. So, these are the course objectives. So, may tatlo tayo. So, ito yung objective natin. After completing this course, the student must be able to number one, explain relevant properties of common construction materials, conduct experiments on common construction materials according to international standards such as American Society for Testing and Materials ASTM since this is a lecture subject so ito kasi two unit lecture one unit laboratory but since this is a lecture video so hindi tayo makakapag conduct na actual laboratory number three evaluate the results of the test of common construction materials so, hopefully, ma-upload ko yung mga laboratory or videos ng laboratory experiment na gagawin namin sa school. Lapi, nagtuturuan ka. So, now let's proceed to the course outline or the topics. So, number one, introduction to construction materials and testing. Familiarization with apparatus and equipment used in testing of materials for number two. Number three, general properties of materials. Number four, the specific weight, water absorption, abrasion, density, and uniformity of aggregates. Five, preparation and curing of concrete test specimens. Six, determination of setting time of hydraulic cement. Number seven, familiarization with the parts and functions of the universal testing machine or the UTM. Number eight, testing of wood. Samples for bending, compression, shear tension, and water content. Number nine, determine the compressive strength of concrete hollow blocks. Number ten, determine the time setting of Portland cement. Number eleven, testing the tensile strength of steel bars and field test of construction materials. So, in this subject, so maging familiar kayo sa iba't ibang construction materials na ginagamit natin sa Philippines and ano ba yung mga pasadong um, parameters para masabing standard or substandard yung materials na ginagamit natin so that would be all for this subject so please like, subscribe and share and abangan nyo yung masusunod natin na uploads